Well, the Marizzi continues, though, for Luton Town in the EFL. Ugh. After today's 5-1 thrashing at Middlesbrough, Rob Edwards was asked to discuss his future. Whatever will be, will be. I'm not in control of that stuff. I love this football club and whatever is best for the football club is is the right thing. Um, I and we have given everything for this football club. You know, I've, been, I've loved my two years. It's been one hell of a one hell of a ride and we've achieved things that we probably no one thought were possible. Um, so if that is it, you know, then um, I and we can hold our heads high that we've given everything. Um, and, you know, if it's not, then we continue to fight. But I understand the question. It's right that it comes... Um, I don't want to be a divisive figure here where the supporters, because you know, they're the most, most important people uh, at any football club, if they, you know, they're the ones that will make that noise and they're the ones that will let us know. And um, so I'm realistic. Um, but I'm proud of the work that we've done here. Today was not a good day and, and uh, over the last few months it's been tough. There's been a lot of challenges and, um, uh, yeah, been difficult. But, uh, but the football club always comes first. You've achieved such a lot, Rob. Can, can you understand, even despite that, the, the criticism from some of the fans, possibly? Of course I can. You know, um, the football fans, are, our fans especially, are, are really intelligent and they want what's best for the club. And, you know, um, yeah, in the end, we want, we want results and we want, we've set a really high bar. And, um, and uh, currently, you know, it's too inconsistent. And um, so I understand their frustration completely. Yeah, as Rob Edwards uh, speaking earlier to Joe Shannon. Um, he's feeling the heat right now, isn't he? They're 21st in the table, Jace. Mm. I think they're gone. Well, well he's it, gone. It sounds like there's a resignation in his voice there. You know, the, mm. it, the, 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 sounds term, defeated. the language he was using, the terminology he was using, I, I think he fears the worst, but it, it, he has done a, what's been a great job for Luton. You know, he's taken them to the Premier League, first time ever. Yeah. But the last six months, mate, it, in fact... Look, they were they were punching last season. They they come up against some big teams at home. Should have could have beaten Chelsea. Could have beaten Liverpool. Could have beaten City. Could have beaten Arsenal. You know all those big dogs, and they come away. I think with one point out of all of those games. You know, yeah, they, I think they, the issue you've got though as well when you go down and the, the, for the players we've had yeah. the taste of it. They a couple, they, they moved yeah. a couple of players on as well, and then and then they go down back to the championship, and they're like, oh, mate, five one. We've got to do this again. It's a bad result that just before the international break. That is a terrible result away. They're four 0 down, got beat five one in the end. They next game they got whole <coughs> city, which they're just above them. So must win. I, I wonder whether they might get the same points. I wonder whether they might give him that, give him that game because after that. It don't get easier. They no. got Leeds United, it's very tight, Norwich City, and I mean, Swansea. They're, there's a lot of teams on 15 are, points, but you know, top the, half is only on 19 points. So they're, they are, but they're, they're at the bottom three and a goal difference only. And the, and the Queens Park Ranger have had a terrible start yeah, to the season. Oh, yeah, and Pompey, they're, they're within touching distance of them. Mm, yeah, I, no. I don't think they're going to go down, but I, I suspect they will give him Hull, give him Hull, mm. and then they'll see where they go from there. Let's go to a Luton fan. Marco's phoned us up. All right, Marco. Hi guys, uh, I phoned you, you, I don't know if you remember, but I phoned you highly charged after we beat Sunderland uh, in the playoffs and you got me trying to get me on my row and then you got me playing the piano. Yes, I do, yeah, I do. Uh, you are full yeah, of beans, weren't you? Shallow. What's that? Full of beans. Uh, incredible, because we didn't expect it at all and it's, it's something that even shooting for the stars. Uh, but the, the, the team we've got now is practically the team that got us up, practically the team that won so many fans and did, did really well for themselves in the Premier League, although we didn't stay up. And now it's it's just, it's the team that's that's languishing near the bottom and potentially could get relegated. And and it could... Oh, here we go. It could be... <laughs> we could lose the players in January as well. And and I don't blame I don't blame the manager. I blame the players because their their, their attitude is, is 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 what's done this because know, they seem more Marco. like the Premier League. Marco, you, when you say you blame the players, right? Ultimately, they're the ones that go on the pitch. So if a team gets relegated, if a team's in bad run, the players are the ones that have to take some responsibility. But it also comes from the top. There's a reason you said to me that most of these players in this team now got promoted. What you know, we're talking just over a, a year ago. Yeah. Got promoted. So what is Rob doing differently? I don't see much of Luton. I see highlights. What have you seen that's different? Why isn't they're Rob just, getting the same just, tune they, out of them then? They seem so blasé. The, the defending is terrible. They, they, they just don't seem to have the same hunger. I mean, they had a bit of hunger when they played Watford, but you can't just do it against your local rivals. 
Look how they played against Arsenal, Chelsea, Man City, Liverpool, who should have beaten Liverpool. You can't tell me that's anything other than mentality. On AM, on DAB, via the TalkSport app and on your smart speaker. TalkSport.